Badfoot. Are you barking mad? You'll blow the entire operation. Sirius, what are you doing here? If somebody sees you... I had to see you last, didn't I? What's life without a little risk? Harry pulled some crumpled robes out of the very bottom of his trunk to make way for folded ones, and as he did so, noticed a badly wrapped package lying in a corner of it. He could not think what it was doing there. He bent down, pulled it out from underneath his trainers, and examined it. He realized what it was within seconds. Sirius had given it to him just inside the front door of number 12 Grim Old Place. Use it if you need me, all right? Harry sank down onto his bed and unwrapped the package. Out fell a small, square mirror. It looked old. It was certainly dirty. Harry held it up to his face and saw his own reflection looking back at him. He turned the mirror over. There on the reverse side was a scribbled note from Sirius. This is a two-way mirror. I've got the other one of the pair. If you need to speak to me, just say my name into it. You'll appear in my mirror and I'll be able to talk in yours. All right. I can see you in this. Who gave that to you? The mirror. The Dungus Fletcher. About a year ago. Don't have no right selling that to you. It belongs Serious. to you. Serious. Albus told me. 